Yeah, obviously devastated with the final result today and particularly our first quarter performance. Um, it was very uncharacteristic for us, particularly after the four weeks that we've had. And I think that's what I'm so proud of is that what this group's managed to achieve and has gone through the adversity that we face on and off the court. And um, I'm, yeah, I'm just so proud of um, the play that we've managed to put together. We finally almost found our brand of netball. And, and I think that's the exciting thing for the future. So yeah, obviously bitterly disappointed to, to finish off the season like that. But I think you've got to hang on to those positives and there are so many what we've been able to achieve. I think that's the exciting thing about this group is um, what we've managed to achieve with the dynamics and the changes that we've had and Kate and Richard have done a fantastic job at holding the fort down and um, bringing their own sort of unique way and, and firing us up over the last couple of weeks. You've got the likes of Kimmy Poy who came and introduced throughout midway through the season, had to pick up things from scratch and she slotted right into that sort of starting wing, wing attack position. Ash dominating in the centre, people out of positions, the likes of Gabby and Tilly as well as our rookies coming up through, really getting some good court time. So the future's definitely looking bright um, and it's obviously one of those that um, we want to reflect on this season make sure we we can take away those positives from it so we move into 2020 in a real good light it's been so humbling obviously this is my first year with the Collingwood Magpies and to see our members sort of turn up and I think that's just grown throughout the season and they've really sort of supported us and that's the sort of motto we run with that the club is side by side and we've really felt that for our crowd as it's, the numbers have picked up with our home and away seasons as well and, and our Magpies members and fans following and travelling around with us and it's so great and we can't do our job without them on court and even playing at the State Netball Hockey Centre today you can really see the, the environment that it creates with the crowd and the atmosphere and we want that. We saw our Collingwood fans there with their scarves shouting us proudly and so we hopefully we look to try and make them proud and do them justice particularly going into 2020.